Mr. Berger Dideriksen, we have just uh, come out of a session on branding here at the Baltic Development Forum Summit. What, uh, in your opinion, are the key benefits from, from such a branding project? Well, in my view, the Baltic Sea region covers uh, considerable resources that have not been uh, fully exploited yet. And to do so, it's important that we have a common identity, both internally in our own region and uh, externally. So I do think that by, that by branding the Baltic Sea region, or the top of Europe as I prefer to call it, we may help to develop the potential talents, attracting foreign investments, etc. Do you think such a project is, is realistic? Is it, uh, is it uh, feasible? Well, as far as I know, it's the first effort done to uh, brand a region composed of uh, several countries, in this case actually 11 countries. It remains to be seen still, if it is doable, uh, but we have some key elements which are of value. We have the Nordic concept of sustainability, and we have the kind of drive the entrepreneurialism of the eastern part of the Baltic Sea region. And by combining these two elements, I hope we can come up with a strong common... In your view, how should we go forward from here in, 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 in this project of, of branding the Baltic Sea region? Well, we have been talking about this uh, for a while, and I would certainly not like that the Baltic Sea region earned the reputation of being a talking shop. So what I think is needed is that some of those uh, institutions that actually have an interest in using the Baltic Sea Region brand or the Top of Europe brand together with their own profile, own national profile, for instance, that they get together, some of them that are most eager, and actually work out how this can be put into practice. You sound optimistic, uh, and, and Simon Anhalt presented uh, three stories uh, at the session. What were your re reactions to those stories? Well, the stories were nice and interesting, but uh, I think the key element that we should go on working on is the Nordic values and the Baltic drive. So talent and sustainability. In this way, the Baltic Sea region may make a difference and serve as a model for the rest of the world, including addressing the increasingly serious problem of uh, climate uh, change.